The name is legendary, its reputation global. But what of the engineers who've made Weir's warm and range of centrifugal slurry pumps and services the world's market leader? Now we're getting about 3,000 hours and we've got about... Between them, Jeff Moore and Craig Walker have more than 70 years experience in making Weir's customers more efficient. Who better to tell the story of Warman than two men who have given their entire career to the technology and its customers? It's pretty, uh, pretty rounded mm. and, uh, and quite soft. It's only about that 550 Brunel. I think Warman means to me uh, an Australian success story. I think Warman uh, it really means the, the, uh, the, probably the pump, um, the AH pump. But I think it also means the um, uh, warm and the guy, uh, who was uh, a pretty amazing person, pretty amazing individual. The warm and story begins in Western Australia in 1938, when mining innovator Charles Warman saw the need to improve slurry pump technology. His designs would set the standard for slurry pump performance, an achievement which continues to this day. The initial uh, Warman pump was, was innovative because of its uh, use of replaceable liners. The, the uh, hydraulic design was quite uh, different. It had some good sealing features. Um, but it was that, that uh, replaceable rubber liners that uh, Charlie Warman uh, was part of that initial patent that I think um, um, that, that really got things rolling. It was better and subsequent models were better than what the competition had. Uh, it solved the client's needs, the brand strength uh, improved, the, uh, the business started to grow globally, and uh, it just had the reputation for performance and reliability. So it was recognised worldwide. We were able to continue to improve the product. But producing the best products requires the best engineers, or as Jeff Moore calls them. Slurry pump nerds, you know, and were really passionate about the product and what it did and the benefits it, it brought to, uh, to the business. And uh, you're going to interview one of the nerds, Craig Walker, who's uh, you know, a, a world leader in, in slurry pumping technologies. It's easy to put a space shuttle on the moon. It is very difficult to understand what is, is happening at a micro level in slurry flow in a rotating pump. And gaining that understanding means collaborating closely with colleagues and crucially customers. We've got people on the client sites every day in every part of the world getting feedback every day from clients. So we have people who understand the client's needs intimately. We've gathered that the expertise that comes through our people to feed into our uh, R&D uh, and innovation projects. One of the things that, that uh, I've loved about um, uh, Warman and, and, and Weir and, and um, when you design something, um, you know, we watch it being made just down there and then you go out to the customer and you see it installed and, and, and operating and when it works you go tick wow wasn't that fantastic and the process of improvement is constant working in partnership with customers to make them more productive and ensure woman continues to be the world's leading centrifugal slurry pump we've got great relationships with a number of our customers and, and, and if we look at our high profile sites, uh, trial sites that we're working with, just again, say, uh, in the Asia-Pacific region, um, there would be uh, 30 or 40 sites where we're, we're trialling different stuff right now. Um, and each of those sites, you know, we report back, uh, we look at the wear patterns, try and analyse what, what we can do better, um, and, and then um, very quickly uh, get something new back out to them. So what makes Warman? The ingredients include passion, deep technical knowledge, and a culture of curiosity and innovation. It's a powerful combination, and one which has attracted attention well beyond Warman's roots, deep in the heart of the mining industry.